G'day guys, James and Andy here, Labour and Wood. Uh, this week's custom bat of the week is a, is a beautiful little light number, Private Vin. Um, a player who's really about the placement of the ball, a uh, very elegant stroke player. You know, he's a slight build, so nothing too, you know, nothing too heavy. Uh, also playing on low slow wickets, so you know, you've got that slightly lower swell position and, and a bit of a hybrid classic special profile. James, tell us a little bit about um, the play you made us for or, uh, and all the steps. Um, yeah, so here we've got something um, a little bit different in the sense that what we're getting is um, a lot of players that want, um, want the lighter bat but don't want all the wood higher up. We tend to find in lighter bats, the wood's a lot higher up. They want the wood low down, so it's still got the lower sweet spot. Uh, but want to be able to um, um, play the shots and actually place the ball where they want to, get the faster bat speed cut shots, pull shots, those sorts of things that really give, you really do rely on bat speed. So mm -hmm. this is really perfect for that. You've got the special profile through there. Um, it's an extended sweet spot. Um, and then um, again, the oval handle that, that just flows through. And with this, um, with the extended sweet spot spine through the back here, um, that really does make it pick up well. So even though it's got a lower sweet spot, it still picks up nicely uh, for a 2-7 bat. And, uh, and yeah, it really works. So, so yeah. a lot of players these days, are busy, you know, there's big talk about having an edge size. Um, there's yeah. this bat with the narrow yeah. edges. Does it affect the, the, the width of the sweet spot at all? Or what's the, you know, um, what's your take on it? The, the take, the, the reality is it's so marginal that the effect in your game is not really um, um, necessarily um, a big one. Um, it's one of those things that uh, ultimately you're looking for a bat that you can actually do something with. If you just go for edges and um, spine height and all that sort of thing, yes it's great, but you tend to find that the bat just feels a little bit um, clunky, it's not quite as good on the bat speed, mm -hmm. um, and so this is just more refined. So you find, find a more refined click cricketer needs that refined bat, and they'll score more prolifically than their averages will go up. And when, when you've got such a light weight and you really increase those edge sizes, the spine height comes down and reduces yeah, the does. The and it's sort of, it's not quite as um, um, straightforward as just a you know big bat with no concaving or anything like that. It do really, you really do want it uh, nicely refined. And a nice refined shape tends to produce a very good bat. Fantastic. Okay,